speaking of, top doctors at Providence speaking out today saying COVID is stretching our local health care system to its limit. They say this strain is even worse now than it was at the previous peak last winter. Just a few days ago, Kootenai Health said it is nearing capacity. Today, Providence said it can usually make more beds available, but the problem is having the staff to take care of the actual patient. We've already broken the previous record here locally for COVID patients in the hospital, and now we are also seeing more children with COVID who need hospitalization. How concerned are you about the start of school here in the next few weeks? And then, of course, the cold weather months uh, shortly behind that. What are we learning from other states that have kind of been ahead of us with this spike? So this, that's a great question. In the, the last surge, as a children's hospital, our role was really to, to figure out how we could support our adult colleagues. That's not going to be as true this year. And we look at, at, at um, Florida, and we look at Texas, um, we look at Georgia, we're seeing huge admissions there where their children's hospitals are at peak. They, are, they have no more space. Um, we have not seen that surge yet here, though we are actively prep preparing for that, both locally and statewide. Now, coming up tonight at 5, I also talked with the CEO of Providence, and he says people in Spokane need to understand our health care system is reaching capacity. And if it gets worse, some patients simply may not be able to get the care they need. That's coming up tonight on Crimson News at 5.